Hello and welcome back to the Imperium, my friends. My name's Galan and this is the Suspicious Cult of the Lost Ones with its little side group, Solace. Solace is under attack by 14 Fennec Foxes. And I don't really know how powerful the Fennec Foxes are, but I don't feel like they'd be that much of an issue. So I think we're gonna open one of these wooden doors and have everybody over here shooting. That way we get lots of juicy, juicy food. Or I can ignore them and just go mining. Uh, but that seems like the boring option, so let's get the team together. Okay, so let's go choose a time to open one of these fucking doors. Probably this one, because they're all kind of over here. Uh, oh, no, that door doesn't need... To... Okay, there we go. Shouldn't close now. Beautiful. Run! This should be fairly easy, I'm hoping. Unless someone shoots, just go. One down. That, okay, maybe this is harder than I thought it was. Three down. Oh, they don't kill them that quickly. Go on, by the had to just go. Whoa, okay, did they, these got. Okay, apparently Fennec boxes are more powerful than I gave them credit for. Fire hazard, hold it, hold in there. Stay alive, please. Can we kill this? Jesus, they do a lot of fucking damage. Okay, we lived. K kind of fucking just. Never rescue snowman. Fire hazard is just gonna go lie down. And we got some free food. That's not bad. But at the same time, I wish we hadn't uh, done that, actually. <laughs> <laughs> that was more costly than I really figured it would be. Whoops. So Biohazard dies in 7, Snowman dies in 13, Shizuku dies in 12. So we, we should be fine. There's, there's plenty of time to heal them up. We've got Trash and Jackie to do so. Trash, please. Uh, are you okay? Because you're probably moving. You, he's going to be moving for a while, but he should be okay. We still have... So I let time play on last uh, after last episode, and the attacked preacher debuff is, is down to 3.4 days. I just need to fucking wait for that to, to go through its course, really. Um, for the rest of the, for everyone to be much happier, especially in Solace. You can see in, in uh, Suspicious, everyone's kind of okay, but Solace is a little bit down. However, for now, please tend. Moving back, we have uh, um, Scarlet and Ambrosia Binge. We've managed to restock our meals somewhat, uh, which is great because we had a bit of a de deficit last time. And seen, everything seems to be going okay. Ooh! Duck Styles is going to be happy. We've got ourselves a good Devil Armstrand chair for his comfort whilst doing the preaching, uh, which is fantastic news. Random guys talking to Billy, Ibarra, and Azura. Obviously, these are the three we have left to sacrifice. Uh, we do have keys. So I've been thinking about a name for keys. And the Neb, an old friend of mine from, from school many, many years ago, uh, we were a, kind of a trifecta with another friend. Uh, who I haven't really spoken to in a long time, but I feel deserves to be in the game. And great memory, tough, artistic, nothing like him. Absolutely nothing like him, but Finders, welcome to the team. <laughs> None of that's true. <laughs> well, actually, I'm not sure about the memory, but most of it's not true. However, we are doing well. We really could do with traders, repeated traders, really, for guns, for getting rid of thrombo horns and elephant tusks and that kind of thing. Okay, so, the wall. Um, these remote doors, I love the idea. I think I would love it if they worked, but they're so completely buggy and the AI, even though, I actually don't think, is this, a, this must be a mod. I can't imagine this would work so badly if it wasn't a mod. But these these steel doors, like you can see that this is meant to be a, this, they're, it's awful, it's horrible. They're meant to work with the door button, they don't work when they're pressed. It's just ridiculous. So, what I've done is I've downloaded a different mod. This one is called Embrasia. You may have seen this quite a lot. If you go on the subreddit, people are always using this. It's a little bit cheatsy, but I think in this situation it's fine. I'm only going to use it to protect the heavy cannons. That will be there than the last thing I will use it for. 
It looks essentially like a normal wall, however there are holes in it. When it is built, you can shoot through it. So it's kind of like a sandbag and a wall put together. They're called embrasures. You can build them out of anything that you can think of. You can have silver ones, fire steel, wooden, jade if you wanted. I'm going to go for granite as it's the most sturdy and I'm going to put them in place of these doors. I really fucking wish the doors worked because it's such an amazing idea of having these automatic doors kind of go and start firing and then lower themselves again. But they're just too fucking buggy. And I believe there is a spot there. If any one of my pawns actually goes in this space, they get stuck there and can't move and then die. Uh, I've tested that a couple of times. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to basically forbid that from being a zone that anyone enters. Uh, for now though, we're gonna delete all this we're going to delete uh, the actual button itself. Yeah, there we go. We're going to replace this with the right embrasures, embrasures, put the guns behind it, and then work on removing door sit. And I hope it won't be so much of a fucking pain in the ass as these remote doors. Ugh. Scorpio's kind of hogging the component section here, and he's not the quickest person in the world. In fact, I think he's literally the slowest. So we will probably have to... Let's just get rid of that component, and somebody else who's quicker and smarter can do that. So we need components quickly. Zyla Blue, can you please work on this? I know you're an amazing individual and you love working on things like, like machine guns and such, but we need components. God damn it. Fantastic, all those doors are gone. That does release six components. We did lose about 20 components trying to build those doors. I'm upset, but not too annoyed because they're out of my life. Right, granite embrasures, please go to work. Oh my god, Karen can now haul. It's so weird seeing a fucking formless mass carrying steel. I love my pets. These embrasures do take quite a bit of work to finish off, much more than a normal standard wall, which is fair. The, the people in the forums just basically do say, there we go, doesn't that look amazing? People do say that the, the embrasures are kind of OP, but I figure it's okay as long as I'm only using it in this one place, then that should be fine. Oh! Where did they come from? Hang on. Did I read? What? We have two new huskies. Victory and Constantin. I do not remember getting these huskies. What? In fact, I don't. I definitely didn't remember getting them because the first thing I always do is make sure they're trained and made to haul. Hooray! We've got some huskies again! We can start breeding! Ah! Huskies 2.0 coming out. Excellent! <laughs> I did not even fucking notice that whatsoever. <laughs> fucking <hell. laughs> This may be slightly too many, but I don't care. We've got one, two, two uranium slug turrets, two auto cannons, another slug, another auto cannon, and, and two more auto cannons. We've just got a whole barrage of fucking guns. That's eight major gun turrets. It may be overkill, but it's going to be so much fun. I can't wait to remove Door City and have this set up properly. Our raid, lovely. I can just put down a couple of solar generators. I do believe we're going to need these as we seem to be running out of power quite a lot here now. And that should be enough to get us until we need to go home. Where are we? Several several separate groups of outlanders from Southwest Colos have arrived in transport pods nearby. They're sapping, so it's probably not solace. Uh, let's have a look. There are people, the grand aunt of Puck. Okay, so drop potting in. What do we have? We have 11 over here with minor weaponry. We have 19 in this group. They do have frag grenades. They're probably the sappers. Now, unfortunately, our melee seems to be mostly weaponless. We've only got Simrex here, who's actually uh, ready to play. Oh, we've got two grenades. God damn it. They're going to break through in no time. But we do have a large amount of firepower sitting waiting for them. Hopefully Simrex can hold them up as well. Oh, one down instantly. Excellent. Simrex just acts as sort of a decoy. Roop, where are you? We need you in the fight, sir. Kalan! God damn it, why am I so slow? Hopefully Roop will draw fire. Goldie's already taken a bullet, so has Nico. Draw that fire, but don't take, don't need a shield, Ruth. Don't need a shield. Get in there. He's lost the shield. 
Get in there, Simrex. Slow him down. Root, you're now kind of just in the open for no reason. Simrex has still got a shield. Just taking the lead hits. Needs to move, needs to move. Put getting some good shots off. Come on, Simrex, move. Yes! That's one group that's fleed. Remember, there are two separate groups. I believe this is the second group coming in now. Roop, you're essentially just going to sit there and wait for them to leave. Simrex, kind of similar. There's now a large fucking hole, but Goldie keeps on widening with that goddamn minigun. But they should be disappointed, like, or disheartened at least, with the amount of bodies and drugs on the floor. Okay, get in there. Get in there, Simrex. Nice. Two down. Fe was it Furnigen? The only survivor so far. But uh, he's not going to survive. Oh, Jerbear's got a better chance, though. Eight hours. Not if he keeps getting shot, of course. Oh, Nissan, you got fucking wrecked. Another down. Jesus, Goldie, you are racking those kills up. Robo Goldie is coming for you, Gator. <laughs> right, that was a pretty fucking successful defense. We've had a few people injured. You guys can leave straight away. The Malia pretty injured. I'm not very injured, though. I'm going to capture Jerbear. Furnigen is just... Oh, we can try. We can try. Who's a quick one? Puck, I believe you're quite quick. Yes, go, go rescue... Uh, or go capture Furnigen. Medical emergency on Furnigen. Random guy's or already on it. How long has she got left to live? One hour. I don't think you're going to make it, random guy, but you are close. Death in point eight, point seven, point six, point five. Oh, this is getting fucking close. Ten seconds, point three. Oh, God, he's just keeping it. Just one more. One more bleed. And once that has been healed, she lives. Oh, that was so close. Let's look what we missed out on. Ah, nothing special. That's so frustrating, though. Uh, please hold Furnigen. Let's not leave her in here. Jervais should be fine. Jackie, can you please arrest that fool? Oh, come on. Come on. Where, where, where's nearby help? Let's just go. Get out of here. Neb has gone a bit of a fury. Um, because he, because uh, Jackie tried to arrest him for insulting it. Can we not have this devolve into somebody dying, please? Oh, they have not they got any medicine over there. Okay, Jackie won. Of course, Jackie won. Jackie took no doubt. Wow, Neb, I knew you were bad, but you're a melee of thirteen. She's a melee of five. How did you literally? not even touch her. Maybe Neb didn't want to. Neb felt bad. He was going on an insult. She tried to arrest him and he freaked out, but he knew deep down he didn't actually want to hurt anybody. That's the only reason I can see how you were so pathetic. Whereas the Neb got fucking torn up with a bionic arm and assault rifle with her fist. Jackie didn't hold back. The reserve battery we started to make a very long time ago is actually able to be made now. The components is the only thing that was fully installed at the beginning, uh, steel and plasteel waiting. But that's actually what we have a surplus of at the moment, rather than the other way around. So, I believe we still have a surplus. Yeah, 773, which isn't too much, but we have just spent several thousand over here on these turrets and such, so I'm, I'm still impressed with the fact we still have 773. Right, who let's have a look. We rescued Jerbear. Iron Will, Psychically Dull, those are both great. Pessimists, not the best, but Iron Will kind of makes up for that. However, not very good at much. I think we've found another sacrificial target. God, we could sacrifice Roop. We're not going to. Let's sacrifice Billy. He's been a bit of a dick. Let's summon another formless spawn. That's going to be a good play right now. And we all enjoy this part. Excellent. Success. Another one. What we're hoping for is a male because we already have two females. Animals, where are you, former spawn one? Hooray! We have a male! Oh, come here, Chad. Now get your groove on and procreate with those other former spawns, please. 
This is good news, people. This is very good news. Oh, lovely. A group of mechanoids from a mechanoid hive have arrived nearby. They're attacking immediately. Oh, my fucking hell! Uh, Houston, we have a problem. 35 scythers. I need everybody, and I mean everybody over there. Random guy, even. Sacrificial shields will be needed here. Holy shit, 35 scythers. You may think, oh, you've got defenses, you've got sandbags. They will run over those so quickly. Oh, fucking good luck to us. Here they come. Oh, God. Kurz, I don't need you to get ready. Okay, actually, probably now's a good time, because they're moving quickly, and this thing takes a while to wind up. One down for the... But the sandbags are gone. No, 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 what are you doing? Aim there. Oh, it's because I because I clicked on a sandbag and then he lost focus because the sandbag died. Why? Oh, because the sandbags keep dying. Just shoot the fucking ground. <laughs> Please. Pull back, pull back. Kalan, move in. Go on, Goldie. I want you to light them the fuck up. That actually barely hit anybody, cause I'm, that's not your fault. That's 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 the game's fault. Yeah, it's not mine. Running guy, be a decoy. Yeah, destroy that turret. It'll kill you. Uh, to Jira. Oh god, Kalan's getting the shit kicked out of him. Uh, Malie, oh god, Finn, oh no! No, the steel mounted grenade machine gun's gone! Oh. Oh, I am so disappointed. Zyla Blue, get on that one. Random guy, get in the way. How many left alive, you say? Nineteen. That's over half. Kalan's down. Okay, Gator, all, all range need to pull back. All range need to pull back, including you, Nico, because that steel mounted gun's going down soon. Zyla, st sorry, Zyla, stay in, in, in range. Uh, yes, duck. We're going to need to utilize your abilities to crush things. I think it's shock. Can you please shock this one? Critical failure. That's not what I wanted to see. Roop, stay in the fight. Simrex, get him. Come on. Oh god, duck, are you still stunned? Oh god. Come on, Root. How many left alive now? 13. Ooh, we've killed 22 Scythers. That's pretty impressive. Root is doing some badass work, though. Hold him off, Root. Zyla Blue, I don't know where you're going, but you're doing well. Duck is still stunned. Holiday, it would be great if you're holding a cypher. Can you just kind of fucking try and help us? Duck is still stunned. Roof down. Simrex. Is it Simrex? Simrex. I thought he was dead. Everyone dies in like nine or ten hours, which is doable. Uh, okay, all our Malia dead. Dead. Down. All our Malia down. We only have. Uh, nine ranged up and ranged fall very quickly to Scythers. Oh, go there, go there. Duck, I need you to move at some point soon, please. But you are being a very, very good magnet for them. Duck, can you move at some point soon? Hey, he's alive. Pol are you kidding me? Oh... My god. One's being carried, 29 on the ground, and I can only assume that means that five were vaporized by a grenade machine gun fire. I am so stunned that we did that. Everybody carry a body. Okay, let's have a look at our medical tab. Oh, that does not look like fun times. Most of everyone's fine. They're just 
dead in seven hours or so. Let's start doing it. Puck, you're on you're on healing duty. If you can stand, you're on healing duty. Oh, look at them, walking through. What are your medicals like, huh? Could you help us? Oh, look, you can help us, you can help us. Assholes. I'm stunned. Not a single extra leg or limb lost against 35 killing machines with sharp blades for, for weapons, for hands. That's, that's impressive. That's very impressive. And we're never going to be able to replace that grenade machine gun unless we can find it on some sort of ship uh, of orbiting it because that's just where we got it from and how you get them. Which is a big shame because that grenade machine gun has been a large part of our, of our defences for a long time and has most likely helped us win a lot of combats. The only saving grace will be that it's come at the end of its life and if we can get these turrets up and running, which does require a lot of components, then we can start showing them from a distance and we may not need it. Oh! Chad and Karen are having the old mating season going on. Yes. Yes, soon. Little spawnlings, formlings, what are they? Formless spawn? Formless spawnlings. They'll be ours. Mine. <gasps> we have our first uranium slug turret. This is going to be good. I am going to prevent the building of the rest of these because we want to kind of save components for a little bit to... in order to work on some bionics because our people are really fucking injured. But getting one of these ready is really fucking sexy. Oh my god, more fucking steel. Are you kidding me? We've got components, we've got plasteel, we've got normal steel. This mine, we've got more plasteel? Oh my god. This place is amazing. I've decided to go and build some lime obelisks in my base. They're going to be red runes glittering down the sides. They pulse with ethereal chaotic powers and they will let quite nicely light up our room. I think this is going to be good for the cult. Takes 300 limestone blocks to do. Doesn't take much work. Jesus, only three. That's insane. How quick are you to put this up? But we're going to build three of them in a nice uh, kind of pattern, hopefully to draw some power from some ley lines or something like that. It'll go nicely with the theme of the red cult. The red hats. And I, I, at the moment, I don't have very many red hats. I do need to get on that. We have quite a lot of Devil Strand. We need more red toques. Holy shit, we have 27 books. When did we get 27 books? Are these, are these all authored by Jackie? Oh no, Green Fox. Who the fuck is Green Fox? Nico. Nico's Green Fox, but because I guess these were made before we named Nico Nico, they're all Green Fox. Wow, you have done a lot of writing, Nico. They are mostly shit, but I, I'm quite impressed. I'm not going to go through them all because that's ridiculous. Excellent. Our second battery is up and running. These two are permanently going to be attached to the grid. If I change the power, you can see these two are going to be permanently attached to the grid, whereas these two are going to be backups. So if I toggle this off. Actually, I do want it on to begin with, just so they can actually power up. But this is going to be a separate battery in case we get a short or something like that. Just the same as this battery uh, down here is. So we're going to have two different available power supplies whilst also maintaining a more batteries on the network as is. This is going to be fantastic. There we go. Beautiful. Look at these fantastic obelisks of Pain. This one's the obelisk of pain. This one's the ob obelisk of rage. This one's the obelisk of domination. And this one's the obelisk of cute puppies. Ma! <laughs> Scarlet's throwing a party. Hopefully, it's not the kind of party that I think she's used to. Um, but everyone's going to join in, have a fantastic time. This is going to certainly raise spirits. Admittedly, oh, don't gather for a sermon that ruins the party atmosphere. Guys, guys, where's, where's, where's that? No, go back to the party. Yay! Look, sermons are great and all, but a party's a party, and who doesn't love a 7 a.m. party? Um, as this is raising the spirits of the team, and as we see, the Solace is not the happy go lucky, pleasant build that it usually is. Uh, although it is just, it's just a mining town. I mean, it used to be so much more. Now, 
I mean, really, it's just completely... I guess it always was about mining. But as we fade away with the party, um, thank you everyone so much for watching. To next episode, we will be working further on this. I don't know... I, I don't really know why I prioritised the power over the guns, but it's done now, and I'm really thinking about getting the hospital finished too. We've got, we're getting goals and we're completing them, just not the ones that we set out at the start of the episode. But thank you everyone so much for watching, I hope you've enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!